All right, ladies and gentlemen, it is time once again for that time of the month. It's our favorite time of the month because March has come and gone, which means we played a lot of weekend league games. We played over 100 games in weekend league, 125 to be exact. And we once again placed inside the top 100 for the month of March in weekend league. I believe we got 83 wins in the month of March. Uh, I'll go ahead and I'll try to confirm that here momentarily. But we did get our monthly weekend league rewards today. Uh, I should definitely be waiting to do this. Not tonight, for sure. But we do it for the content. We do it for the content. So we take a look here. This is last. This is this month. We'll take a look here at last month. <laughs> I believe we placed 80th on the Xbox leaderboards right down here. No, I think we're farther up. There we are. 71st in the world. We actually won 84 games in the month of March. So pat myself on the back there. Yay me. Another month where we finished inside the top 100 in the world on the Xbox Series S. So without further ado, we are going to rip open our weekend league reward packs. Don't mind all these packs. These are the ones that we are going to open right here. We're also going to open our regular weekend league packs from this past week too. Might as well. In total, we're opening a lot of packs. We're opening a lot of packs. Two Hail Marys, two midfields, two red zone, three touchdowns. We're going to open up three ultimate legend fantasy packs. These packs suck. And then a fire fantasy pack. This pack guarantees, I believe, a 96 plus guaranteed. And then also an ultimate legend guaranteed. So I definitely should not be doing this on Thursday. If you guys got the fire fantasy pack from Weekend League, wait until Saturday to do it. Don't do what I'm doing. Don't be stupid and open it now. I'm open it for the content though. <clears throat> Save it for your chance of possibly pulling a limited time ultimate legend. So without further ado, let's rip these packs. Hopefully I have enough binder space. I, I probably won't. I'll probably have to quick sell some things here. We're just gonna quick sell all this crap we get out of the Hail Mary pack. Yeah, we we'll just see, like we just get nothing. Like, we'll, we'll save the power-ups, I guess, but everything else is getting quick sold here out of these trash weekend league packs here. The midfield, red zone, Hail Marys, all these are getting quick sold because I just don't care. Now, there are limiteds in packs. I believe Trent Williams is one and then Jalen Brown. Terrible limiteds, but I mean, hey, they're in packs, it's something. The Easter promo, Sugar Rush is what it's called this year, is dropping tomorrow, which is Friday. I'm recording this on Thursday night. As we get, okay, we get a couple of uh, couple of elites there. We'll just quick sell all the rest of that. Midfield pack number two here. Please don't be mid. Please be better than mid. That would be greatly appreciated. Hey, asking you shall receive a 91. Not bad indeed. Definitely, uh... That's a good pull. It's a good pull. How much are you going for? Nothing. Going for nothing. Good pack. That was a good midfield pack. All right, we get two red zone packs out. Two red zone packs. We're heating up. We are heating up. Just like in beer pong. Get a couple in a row, you're heating up. All right, we get an 85. We get an 86 pouncy. A Mariota power up. KGB power up. All right, this pack was actually solid. Pretty much all 80s except for this card. It's not horrible, but it's not no 99 overall limited. Another freeze card at 83, 84. Superhero card. Uh, this is this is a colorful pack. Okay. You know it sucked. It was colorful. Okay, cool. Well, honestly, I'm probably just gonna end up quick selling all these cards anyway, dude, for training and whatnot. All right. Touchdown packs. We get three of these bad boys. Three of the I I remember when these packs were actually like the most fire packs of all time, bro. I remember just a few short years ago when touchdown packs used to be just the best. All right, this is a big legend. 92, okay. Maybe maybe talking about the old touchdown packs is rubbing off here. Who knows? But that was not a bad pack. We got a 92. I'll take it. Yeah, these packs used to be insanely good. I remember I think it was the first year they had Weekend League, which was Matt 19. What's this? 
88 okay veteran animation kind of caught me off guard there anyways back to my original schedule programming Madden 18 I believe was the first year maybe Madden 19 was the first year they had weekend league no I think it was 18 pretty sure it was Madden 18 was the first year they had weekend league and I remember pulling absolute heat out of the touchdown packs they were amazing <clears throat> obviously they're nowhere near as good as what they used to be because there's no coin quick sell option either which they completely doghoused the coin quick sells this year man uh kind of crazy okay we're getting old cards but we're getting cards oh my goodness a 95 shit wait a minute yo I did, what the hell two of the same card in the, what? okay this 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 reminds me of the old touchdown packs right here this this is actually fire i can't lie this is probably my best touchdown pack of the year. 95 Aaron Glenn. Not a bad pull. 70K. That's actually pretty solid. We're going to quit. We're going to sell him right now. Get out of my binder. We'll put him. Actually, no, we'll put him up for uh, 69,000 coins. 69K. Pretty nice. Pretty nice. All right. W pack. Absolute W. All right. Now we get into our actual <laughs> packs. Three ultimate legend fantasies. One fire fantasy. Y'all know my opinion on these packs. They suck. This is the only time I'm going to open these packs is when I get them for a weekend league rewards. Other than that, they stink. Not a bad first round. They gave us some 49er love. They gave us Jimmy G. They gave us Devo. All right, round two, a 91. We get two ultimate legend selections in this round. We just get one. Oh, we get two. We get to pick two. An 88 and an 87 we're just gonna take i don't know we'll just take the 88 and the 91. these packs garbage absolute garbage bro <laughs> absolute garbage two more though two more of these garbage packs can we pull anything that's relevant or anything that's like good is it possible an 89 oof and the the, uh, the touchdown packs looking way better than these. A 91 Dick Lane, an 88 Campus Legend, 89 and an 88. All right, we'll take the 89 and the 91. Packs stink. They really, really stink, guys. They really stink. Last one, and then the misery is over, and then we get our fire fantasy pack. Come on, baby, come on. Trey Lance, Sony Michelle, and a whole lot of nothing. 87 Vic, 91 Dickerson. How's this? Oh, heavyweight animation caught me off guard. And 91 too tall. All right, at least we got 91s. All right, at least we got 91s. It's fair enough. All right, booty cheeks, booty cheeks. And now I have to clear out some space in my binder. Love doing this, love doing this. All right, we can have to clear out at least nine spaces. So uh, yeah, I'm just gonna quick sell a lot of these cards here. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and just round up to magic a magic 10 all right nice we just sold uh we just sold to marcus Ware. marcus Ware finally up the team after being on the team for a while all right fire fantasy pack we get a guaranteed ultimate legend a full one i think we also get a guaranteed 96 plus there are another there's some expensive reduxes that are in packs that'd be great obviously a full ultimate legend would be great as well here we go we're just full sending it Fire Fantasy Pack, this is what we get for top 100 of the month. A 96, that is Mike Pouncey cornerback. Absolutely sickening. A 98, Ozzy Newsome. Okay, okay, big dubs there. And, and a 96, Jason Peters. It's pretty obvious who we're gonna take here. We're gonna take Ozzy Newsome. Not horrible, not horrible, but not the worst. 200K is what he's going for, bro. Yikes, 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 yikes. All right, there it was. Honestly, the touchdown packs were <laughs> definitely caught me on guard. So that was that was probably not the best pack opening that we've gotten for the, for the monthly rewards. I still think the monthly rewards are like super good. Because when I mean, we damn, we just pulled a 98 overall, and we got some really good packs there. But it's just like, you know, it is what it is. Um, you just can't really 
have very high expectations when you're pulling those packs. Otherwise, you're going to be disappointed. And I, I'm honestly, I'm perfectly fine because I was not expecting to get much of anything, which we really didn't. So, yeah, that is going to do it. Thank you guys for tuning in. We'll catch you in the next one.